What is up guys, it is Master Of here, welcome back to Clash of Clans for this super special episode. This is a massive thank you for 30,000 subscribers. We are spending a whole chest of gems in this episode. That is right, we are buying a 14,000 gems and spending them. Just because I've hit 30,000, I want to do this every time I hit 10,000 milestone. So next one obviously 40,000 and each 10,000 milestone I want to do a chest on here or a crate on Boom Beach and also do a giveaway for you guys. So I hope you enjoy this. Uh, we're going to run through some things that I've really wanted to upgrade and buy recently so um, let's do this so this is gonna cost us a hundred dollars this bit will obviously be uh, blanked out as I put in my personal information uh, and get ready for this bye there we go look at those gems so we now have 14,000 gems to spend this is gonna be absolutely crazy so the first things first I cannot, I cannot say how much you should do this. If you're starting late on Clash of Clans like I am, personally I start Clash of Clans later than most big Clashes out there, you want to do this. You want to buy an extra builder's hut. Um, I don't know why I didn't just build it. Oh wait, I've got to actually put it down somewhere. I'm going to double up the builder's huts down here. Boom, there we go. 2,000 spent straight away, but totally worth it because... Having five builders on the go all the time is just so, so important, at least in my eyes, that I really recommend you should do it. So, it's just something I definitely recommend you should do. Anyway, so what we're going to start off doing is uh, basically skipping all these times. So, let's skip all these times. Uh, so, we have all of our builders free. Uh, where's this last one? There, No, that's not it. That's research. There it is. So we now have all of our builders free, which is pretty cool. And we can go and upgrade some stuff. So the one thing I don't like doing is gemming resources. So if you don't have the loot and resources that you need, I really hate gemming that bit. But because we're spending them all today, I probably can't help it. But otherwise, I always like to go out and get my loot and stuff. And if I have gems to skip it, uh, sometimes I just will. So as you can see, I'm also boosting gold mines and stuff. So I get as much gold uh, and elixir as possible. Anyway, so we've now got our five builders. All of them are free. We've got this research as well. Should we skip this research? There we go. So now we can only upgrade uh, our two spells. Oh, we've got a brand new spell as well. I haven't even used that spell. Let's make sure to create it. Uh, and we can use that in this video. So... I think we should research everything to the to the top level before we upgrade it again. Now, personally, I am not a big fan of spells. I really don't like them, but I will uh, gem this spell, and uh, now we're done with that. I'm going to upgrade... Oh, I can't upgrade it, so that's fully upgraded. So we might even get most things fully upgraded to Town Hall Level 7 now, uh, so that soon we'll have to upgrade. So let's start off with the mines. All of my, all of my mines are now fully upgraded, I believe. Yeah, they all seem to be. Okay, here we go. So this has got two things, uh, two levels. Be yeah, and we leveled up. Booyah. This has now got another level, and that is now top level as well. That is absolutely beast. Wait, let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. Uh, that must mean I have one elixir pump somewhere that needs to be upgraded. Aha. No, that's not it. Aha. That is it. That's level seven. This one looks small as well. That's a level nine. That's a level seven. So both of these need to be upgraded. So, um... That's fine, we can end the boost to upgrade stuff, and uh, then we'll upgrade that, and now we can upgrade this, so that's fine, end the boost, upgrade, upgrade, absolute beast, and one more, there we go, that is the one thing I love about doing this, and another level up, yeah, that is how we roll guys, okay, let's try this again, what can we now do to uh, upgrade, so all of our uh, collectors or pumps or whatever are fully upgraded, our spell factory is fully upgraded. Our cannons, oh, interesting, cannons, fully upgraded to level 7. So let's check our cannons. Level 7, level 7. They're all level 7. Mortars, uh, oh, the mortars can be upgraded. Oh, awesome. All right, so we're going to have a lot more uh, a lot more firepower now with these mortars fully upgraded. Uh, we're going to have to buy those. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm going to have to buy some of them now that we've run out of loot. Uh, we'll go and attack, actually. Uh, in a second, if we haven't got anything else elixir-wise that we need to upgrade. So, arch towers, level... We, so, we can upgrade them to level 7. Is this level 7? Yeah, so level 7 is max. Uh, I've got two on level 6. So, we do need some loot. You know what? Let's go and attack and get a little bit of loot. Oh, my God. We're actually missing gold to go and attack. So, can I collect from this to get, like, enough gold? Uh, is that enough gold? Yeah, <laughs> that's enough gold. I've never had that before. Um, oh, my God. We're going to have to buy gold until we find a, a good a good base to attack. Tragic. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. I should have just used these um, gems anyway. Alright, let's use this one. 
uh, to get this, so... You know what, let's just uh, use everything in this. Let's just send them all in, see if we can freestyle this guy and take all his stuff. We hopefully might be able to. Um, completely depends, really. His stuff kind of spread out really well. So I'm going to put that around there. I've got a hog rider as well. Uh, that's quite cool. And I'm going to spread my goblins around. Let's see if we can take him out. Hopefully we'll get a little bit of loot this one. Not quite sure what happens. Take him all. Alright, it looks like we've taken all his loot. So, that's worked out pretty well. And so the Hog Riders. The Hog Riders have literally destroyed his base. So the Hog Riders are just jumping over and taking everything out. Ready for this Arch Tower to go in 3, 2, 1. Destroy! That worked out really well. Um, awesome. So there we go. So we've got another 50,000 loot on both, I think, there, which is quite cool. And we 100%ed it. Uh, so another 50 odd thousand, which is quite nice. Uh, kind of pointless, but I thought I might as well do it anyway. Let's just request. Oh, can I upgrade this? Uh, I can actually upgrade my clan castle. I really need to do that. So, let's upgrade that and skip that as well. Can I upgrade it again? No, I can't upgrade it again. So, next up was the archer towers. Uh, the max archer tower is level 7. Oh, level 5 wizards. Thank you very much, my friend. Uh, so, let's upgrade these as we do. We've got another 5,000 uh, gems left now to do. So... What else can we upgrade? What else can we upgrade? So this is fully upgraded. This is fully upgraded. The storages are fully upgraded. The clan castle is fully upgraded. The air defense is not. Oh my god, five days. That is taking so much elixir. Oh, elixir? Uh, so many gems, but that's fine. Uh, what else have we got here? So, the wizard towers. Alright, the wizard towers need upgrading too. Both of those need upgrading. The mortar doesn't. So if I upgrade these two, that'll be everything upgraded. Sorry, uh, this one. That'll be everything upgraded in the middle section here. And also everything upgraded on the outer section, I believe. Oh no, sorry, all of those upgraded. All of them are upgraded. And the research lab is fully upgraded as well. Alright, so let's go around the side here. So we've got the spell factory fully upgraded. Uh, the barracks... The barracks, okay, the barracks can all be upgraded. That is going to cost a lot of elixir. A lot of elixir, a lot of, well, a lot of elixir and a lot of gems. Uh, the camps need to be upgraded. Alright, and can we upgrade these? No, we can't upgrade those. So literally, once we upgrade these uh, camps and the barracks over there, I believe that is it. And we have fully upgraded Town Hall 6. So, let's see if we can do this in this in this episode. Um, I don't know if we're going to be able to, because that's quite a lot of stuff we need to buy. I think it'd probably be best to do um, to do the army camps first. So, I, actually no, it probably wouldn't. It'd probably be best to do barracks, because then I can still go and get some loot once these are fully upgraded. So, let's uh, let's kind of skip ahead on that one. So, please tell me that's, that's fully upgraded. Oh my god, we can get dragons next? That's insane. I didn't know we could get dragons this early. I say this early, I've been playing for a bit. Alright, so it looks like we're going to be able to upgrade this, and then we're going to have to stop, guys. That is there, and for level 47, that is all of my coins, gems spent, sorry. That is 100 bucks, or 60 pounds, uh, spent... We only have left to upgrade on here these three. So I hope you enjoyed the episode, guys. This is just for both of us as a massive thank you uh, for 30,000 subscribers. Absolutely insane. The next um, the next $100, 60 pounds, or um, what are they called? Chests? Are they chests? I think they're chests. Yeah, or chests of gem spree. Will it be at 40,000? So if you want to see that, I really want to see that and want to do it. So if you guys can get people to come and subscribe and whatever, we can then do this. Uh, I'm doing a giveaway for you guys on Saturday, so look out for that. There's like four cards going up, all worth around, I think, $100 in total so that's pretty epic and i'm trying to find something for us uh, international people as well not just the americans so thank you guys again until the next episode peace out